Hello Aquarius! Welcome to your love reading, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Aquarius, this is a collective love message for your signs, so please take it how it resonates and what resonates for your overall situation. Let's see Aquarius. Let's see what do we have for you. What do we have for Aquarius? What do we have for Aquarius? This honest. Mm. Let's see. What do we have for Aquarius? True love. An anxiety. Okay. The other woman. We had that when while I was shuffling, we had that betrayal. Soulmate the one. Oh my gosh. Aquarius, what I am getting here very, very strongly is that you might be you might be suspecting here that this person is is entertaining here someone else because I see that an anxiety about the other woman or the other man please take it how it resonates and it's like I feel that you are anxious that this person betrayed your trust because while we were shuffling there was a bit card of betrayal the thing here that you have someone who seems to be in love with you Aquarius they see you as they true love only you it's like they are reassuring you the one only you soulmate like this person really sees you as their soulmate but there is something here that you might be suspecting or you're kind of anxious that this person might not be fully transparent in a sense that they are hiding something and that there might be another situation that they might be involved in, right? But it feels like this person here, it's focusing only on you. Interesting, let's see. Could you please show me more about the situation, what's going on about this person? Let's see. Let's see. Four of Pentacles. Three of Swords. What do we have here? Temperance. Six of Wands, Knight of Cups. The full Queen of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles, the Magician. Okay, what I am getting here, Aquarius, quite strongly, that you have history with this person. It's like you gave this person another chance. And the reason why you might be uh, cautious or kind of suspecting here this person to indeed um, like suspecting that there might be someone else is because they've put you in the past in that sort of kind of situation. Mm hmm. You might be dealing Aquarius, uh, you might be dealing with Sagittarius, I have your energy Aquarius, Aries, Virgo, Gemini, yeah. This is something to do with uh, situation from the past. This is someone who put you in a third party situation in the past. They met someone.
and they this 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 person it's like they this they they got distracted and they start focusing on that another person for some of you this is like someone's uh, baby mama I'm getting here and it's like you might be feeling I don't know if this person is still I feel that you are anxious about some sort of kind of another woman here I'm getting strong feminine energy like it's not over between the two of them for some of you this is someone yes with whom this person might have children with it's like they ex and this ex is constantly kind of um in their life it might be a case they are communicating they are very nice and you might be suspecting them well maybe they will reconcile and for some of you this is just a sit just it is a situation essentially he's like um this person put you in the past in a third party situation and it's like yes you kind of forgive you 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 might have forgiven them but that four of pentacles suggests here that you are still holding on to that three of swords that situation that happened in the past that breakup that heartbreak um that emotional disappointment and dissatisfaction that this person caused you it's like i feel that um and i'm going to be honest with you aquarius i feel that you you see it's like this person is focusing on this and that beautiful energy of temperance i feel that you you haven't fully healed from that disappointment and it feels like it take takes time it, it it's like it feels weird because this is a divine timing card so it feels like you might be in need of more time to kind of process what happened here in the past but i feel that you've kind of welcomed this person back to your life and you know how it is it's like there was that breakup this person kind of betrayed your trust not kind of they betrayed your trust and because you you didn't fully kind of let go of that feeling represented by the three of swords you might be suspecting that this person is going to do the same thing again there is a i feel that you know there is a trust issue uh, present here in that situation and for some of you 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 might be kind of uh um, anxious here or kind of worrying about that that person that this person was involved in the past and it's like they have some sort of obligations you know and you might be feeling here that with the knight of cups this person is going to reconcile with with their ex because of the or because children are involved in that situation and you will experience again that uh, free of source and that makes you an anxious or stressed or worried in general the thing is here that you have someone who kind of sees you as their soulmate. Is this person is loves you? Only you, the one. There is some sort of support for some of you. This person has to kind of they have obligations they need to provide. I have six of wands. For some of you, it might be a case here that this ex wants this person's attention, so they are just texting them all the time, asking for some sort of kind of, uh, oh, can you do this favor to me, you know, um, or like there is a birthday party, can you attend, you know, something like this. Magician. You're manifesting here. You're manifesting a change. Looks complicated indeed. Show me this person's feelings towards Aquarius. We have the Hierophant. You might be dealing with Taurus. Show me this person's feelings towards Aquarius. 
Six of Swords. And the Moon. This person feels that you don't trust them. Mm -hmm. You might be dealing with Pisces as well. I'm seeing someone. I promise. I'm making a. I promise you. I've detached from that situation. Nothing here. It's happening. But it's like with the moon. They are aware that you have doubts. And that you're not trusting them. Mm-hmm. That's why on emotional level with the seven of wands, this person feels that they need to prove it to you that uh, they are worthy of trust, that you can trust them. But this person is very, very kind of in their emotions. You have someone who wants a higher level of commitment with you, but they are also aware that you don't trust them. It's like they might be kind of promising you that nothing is going on here or that they kind of want, want, once and for all detached um, on 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 an intellectual level on emotional level as well from that situation that happened here in the past whatever that might be please take it how it resonates for your personal circumstances but they feel that they need to do more work in order to gain your trust four of swords there is a need to heal this three of swords mm -hmm. show me this person's action show me this person's actions towards Aquarius three of Pentacles show me this person's actions towards Aquarius please seven of Pentacles the devil and we have six of Pentacles Three of Cups. You might be dealing with Capricorn. Aquarius, this person here will express that they want to work with you in order uh, to build a far more stable situation regarding this connection. Seven of Pentacles. This is someone who will tell you that they are very invested. But with the devil, indeed, it feels here very strongly that this is someone who has some sort of obligations. And with the Six of Pentacles, I'm getting for some of you that's very visible here that they need to provide to someone else. Oh, it's like they need to... Uh, and it's like they are with this energy. I don't feel that they are very happy because it feels like this person is metaphorically saying tied to the circumstances. So I'm getting here for some of you indeed that there might be an ex and this person like they were in a relationship or they were married, they divorced, whatever the case might be. They parted ways. But there is something here regarding finance, fin finances that this person feels obliged to provide. Because it's like giving to another situation, but in the form of a material finances, material situation. And they are not happy here with the circumstances because this person is tied. It's like there is nothing else for me to do. I need to do it. I'm not happy with this. I feel a little bit trapped regarding this whole situation, but that's, that's what I need to do. That's what I am getting very strongly here for someone but it's like i feel this person really i feel it's there is something here about them i understand if you don't trust me um i'll be patient you know it's like i am here for a long for a long time i want to stay a long time you know i want to stay in your life for a very long time i'm not going anywhere that's what i am getting i want to work on this situation with you and Within time, we will see the we will see the, the the benefits of that commitment because this person is very invested in this connection. But at the same time, they have a certain ties here. I feel this person it's not it's exhausted. They are not happy with this situation, but it's like they need to provide to someone else. Mm -hmm. Three of Cups. In this case here, this person wants to bring more happiness, joy, fulfillment to the situation.
show me the outcome show me the outcome five of wands show me the outcome seven of cups and the tower judgment okay so you might be dealing with aries we have very strong scorpio aquarius well what i am getting here aquarius that the situation is not ideal at the end of the day for you five of wands suggests that it might i'm going to be honest with you it might be a case that at some point you will vo vocalize <laughs> your opinion about the state of affairs here between you this person and that another person that might be involved in that situation and you might say listen it's too crowded with the five of wands you might even kind of express some sort of frustration here and it might be simply a case of for instance if they are dealing here with with an ex you might say listen there there has to be put some boundaries here she she cannot just call or demand you know it's like you know what i mean someone who's constantly trying to get that person's attention and with the five of ones you might feel like i don't want to compete here with anyone because this is also a card of competition i don't want to compete with this person i don't want to do i don't want to be put in that position it's frustrating I, it might be you might be feeling it's causing uh, uh, disagreements between us it's it's difficult for me it, it's creating tensions and with the seven of cups you might feel you might kind of express to this person what you truly want what do you want because you need to put a, there is a need for this person to put the boundaries like a strong and healthy boundaries between them and that ex the tower and at the end it's i feel that you know something here indeed will change i feel something here will change and it will be sudden change unexpected i see an argument i'm going to be honest with you five of one seven of cups uh, and the tower it's like there is this elephant in the room and it's like you feel that it's there and it's like people are walking around that situation not addressing this that much but at some point there will be a situation or time that something here will be said and i feel that you will express your frustration here and the tower moment will happen however that tower can be rebuilt because we have a judgment as an overall energy and the judgment suggests that this person will try to resurrect this connection and they will try to rebuild this this energy i'm just seeing you getting through like day by day there's something here that frustrates you with the five of wands and i feel that at some point that situation will gain momentum and you will just simply express how you've been feeling about this and based on those reading you have someone who loves you uh, you are their true love they sees you as their soulmate they are into you but the whole situation it's not ideal and i can completely understand why you might be feeling the way the cards are showing here because it's difficult because i feel that you that this person is dealing, dealing here with uh, an ex who who might be very demanding and it's like this ex is doing it on purpose texting them asking them for favors uh can you go here or can you can you do this for me or this this and it's like it's difficult if that's not the ex i'm getting here that you know with the five of one seven of cups and the tower i'm seeing here quite strongly that indeed there will be a conversation and i feel that you will kind of you will tell this person something that you've never had a chance to tell them 
about the past, about that third party that they might have put you in. And I feel that the tower moment will happen. But again, with the judgment, there, there will be an opportunity here to resurrect this connection and actually build, in both cases, rebuild this connection in more stable kind of foundations. Because the tower is happening at the first place because something hasn't been built or hasn't been built it hasn't been built on a strong foundations, but rather built in that kind of flimsy, flimsy foundations. And it didn't really have a chance to blossom into something beautiful. So something here in the really kind of, it feels like uh, that tower moment will be um, liberating for both of the parties. And you have here that judgment and that opportunity that this connection will be given to be rebuilt essentially in a more stable foundations because let's not forget at the end of the day you have someone here who is in love with you and they don't want to give up on this connection and they won't give up on this connection irrespective here of that tension or argument that might take place or disagreement no the judgment here suggests that things will be okay that this connection you know will be given a chance to 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 be resurrected essentially and just to both of you to make peace with 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 each other and 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 things will change but things will change for the better that's what i want to say okay this person loves you aquarius and they know that you don't trust them but you have someone here who wants a high level of commitment with you. However, I can see how this situation and your feelings um, about this whole thing, yeah, that situation can be quite, quite challenging. I completely understand that. But you, it feels like you have nothing to worry about because even if that tower moment happens, it, it will bring uh, that liberation this person will be completely aware of, the, of, of how you've been feeling about this. And based on this, they will change the circumstances. And that change will only be for, for the better. Aquarius, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Aquarius, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. I am sending you much, much love. Till next time, take care. Bye.